little bit about why it's important for native language preservation? First of all, um, language preservation is very, very uh, important and near, to, near and dear to me, for one, um, because um, my experience, uh, you know, uh, working with the elders and, and learning the language is that this is how we view the world. This is the language is very, very important to our people. That is how we see the world. And all the concepts that are in the language is very, very um, important to our people. And you had mentioned about your tribe and some of the work being done. Can you share a little bit about that? Sure. We're actually, uh, uh, we were actually the first indigenous people in the entire world to be recorded. So a gentleman by the name of um, uh, Jesse Walter Fuchs, uh, an anthropologist, came to Calais, Maine to record the Passamaquoddy people on Thomas Edison's wax cylinder machine. So we were actually the first indigenous people in the entire world to be recorded. Why is it important to have these uh, PBS type of Native America too, um, panels, radio, to share Native stories and including the Native language uh, preservation? It's so important for us to be able to engage in this dialogue and, and to be able to extend a lot of this intellectual knowledge and this, this knowledge that's been handed down for our people for thousands of years that has been suppressed and oppressed for such a long time. And it's so important for us to be able to come together, to be able to unite, to be able to have, solve these common problems uh, because we have a lot to share uh, uh, to the world. And what would you like the public to know? I would like to know uh, the public to know Mejide Yurgilun Kdiotibun in our language means we are still here. Thank you. Thank you.